Hey, Captain Joe Rains here for Head First Fishing. Thanks for coming to check out this video. Got a couple power pole tips for all you power pole fishermen out there. I love the power pole. This is an older XL model. It's helped me catch a lot of fish in the shallows. Highly recommend getting one of these if you don't have one. They're a Tampa Bay, Florida local company. Really great customer service. Actually had an older spike. This thing's seen a lot of use. The spike finally wore out. It gave out and slipped out and I lost my spike. I called power pole and within 48 hours they had another spike at my door really amazing outstanding customer service can't say enough about them um, so one of the things we need to be doing with our power poles is just checking on these connections here making sure these bolts and the nuts and washers are still in good condition so fortunately i was able to reuse these bolts and these nuts and the washers here for this connection right here for the spike i went from there and went up here and looked at these connections and actually with just a little bit of turning I actually snapped the bolt off so it's impressive that that was still working before that but I went ahead and went to the hardware store and found some good hardware to replace that got the washers replaced now it's back in good working condition the other thing we need to check here is how well it's mounted here to its mounting plate which goes ahead of the jack plate so after some time this will begin to wobble a little bit bounces around it's getting pulled on when you lower it down into the flats so that's a little bit loose so I'm gonna need to come in here I'm gonna put that into the position it really needs to be in right there all right I got my wrench on the back let's take my half inch socket right here let's go ahead and tighten that up I can feel the resistance on the wrench let's check these on the bottom here looks like we got another loose one here you can see that moves a little bit Go ahead and tighten that up. Looks like I've got the wobble taken out of this power pole. It was sliding around on its mount there. Not doing that anymore. Got this hardware replaced, got my new spike. It's ready to go out fishing again. Definitely check out power pole. If you want to get into shallow water fishing, you gotta have one of these on the back of your boat. Thanks for coming to check out today's video. Please check out our sponsors, St. Pete Fishing Outfitters, Tampa Fishing Outfitters, and Tarpon Fishing Outfitters, the place to get fitted to fish. Also, check out the Pike Consulting Group. Do you have a business where employees are exposed to health and injury risks? Go to pikegroup.net to get your safety consultation set up.